Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another recruiting news for Dummies video. And today we're going to be talking about some big recruiting news. Well, the first recruit we're going to talk about is Cameron Coleman. He's a five star wide receiver in the class of 2024. He's the number 11 recruit nationally, the number three wide receiver, number one recruit coming out of the state of Alabama. He has recently committed to play football at Texas AM. Uh, he picked Texas A&M over schools like Auburn, Clemson, LSU, Alabama, but obviously he had offers from everywhere. He's one of the best receivers in this class, one of the best athletes overall. Huge pickup for Texas A&M as they're starting to get some big momentum on this recruiting trail for 2024. Um, so yeah, really big pickup for them. Uh, pretty pretty happy for Cameron. See what he can do in the SEC at Texas A&M. Um, but yeah, it's a big time pickup. All right, so the next recruit we're going to talk about is four-star offensive tackle in the class of 2024, Daniel Calhoun. Now, Daniel is the number 98 recruit nationally, the number six offensive tackle, and the number 15 recruit coming out of the state of Georgia. He just recently committed to play football for Georgia. He picked Georgia over schools like Alabama, Auburn, Tennessee, and Texas. Um, it's a good pickup for the dogs, making their front line on that offense stronger. Um, and Daniel's just a massive human being. I mean, he's six, six and a half, 355 pounds. I mean, he's just a big dude. So, uh, this, hopefully he can, um, stay in shape, stay on the field, get that athleticism up. And he's probably going to be a force to reckon with on that offensive line. All right. So the next recruit we're going to talk about is four star wide receiver in the class of 2024, Elijah Moore. Now, Elijah has recently committed to play football at Florida state. Um, the only reason this is kind of big news is because it seemed like he was an Ohio State lean for a long time. But it seems over the last couple of weeks to month that he's been flipping towards Florida State after that official visit he had with Florida State. Um, there was predictions put in for Florida State. Um, it seemed like Ohio State really wanted this guy, even though he's not the highest recruit out there. Um, but when Ohio State wants a wide receiver, it's got to mean something because Ohio State is producing wide receivers left and right. Um, I would assume the deciding factor was Florida State telling him to look at the room at Ohio State. The wide receiver room is stacked. They have two five stars coming in in this exact class. So he probably just wants to see the field and see this field as soon as possible. Um, so it's probably the best decision for him. Um, so yeah, pretty good pickup for Florida State and excited to see what Elijah can do. All right, so next up, we're going to do a more rapid fire approach of commitments that have happened over the last couple of days. These are the bigger commitments that have happened over the last couple of days. So there's not going to be a whole lot of them. Uh, first up, we have Tyshawn White, four star safety going to North Carolina. We have Emerson Mandel, four star offensive tackle going to Wisconsin. We have Ashton Bethel Roman, four star wide receiver going to Arkansas. We have Kylan Fox, four star athlete going to UCF. We have Cameron Keys, four-star cornerback, going to Missouri. We have James Madison, the second four-star wide receiver, going to Missouri. We have Dykus Brinkley, four-star edge, going to Kansas. And we have Elias Rudolph, four-star edge, going to Michigan. All right, next we're going to talk about some crystal balls from some of the more known recruiting analysts from around the nation. I only have a couple of them here. Uh, first up, we have Nick Marsh. 2024 four-star wide receiver has been predicted to go to Michigan State by Alan Treu, and we have four-star safety in the class of 2024 Jacob Good, who's been predicted by Steve Wiltfong to go to UCF. All right, so this is the more shocking breaking news over the last couple of days. I have a couple uh, pieces of news here. Um, so take these with a grain of salt. This is more like not really confirmed, but some chatter has been going around about these couple of players. Um, so we have five-star defense at end. Elijah Rushing has been predicted to Arizona on on three. On three has him going to Arizona in their prediction thing. Um, he's a top 10 player in the country and is considered an Oregon lean for a long time before this prediction to Arizona. So this would be a huge pickup for Arizona because it's one of the best players in the country in 2024. And last but not least, we have five-star and number one linebacker in the nation, Demarcus Riddick, is leaning towards backing off his commitment to Georgia and committing to Alabama per director of recruiting Steve Wilfong. Now, this would be a huge flip for Alabama since this is the number one linebacker in the nation. He's been committed to Georgia for a while now. And for him to back out of his commitment and go to Alabama is definitely saying something. Um, so we're just going to have to wait and see if this actually plays out. But this would be a huge flip for Alabama. Yo, thank you guys so much for watching another recruiting news for dummies video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell to get alerts on every new video that I drop. And I'm out.
Peace.